Prime Minister, the Honorable Dr. Ralph Gonzalez, on his recent state visit to the Republic of China and Taiwan, made a number of visits to different institutions and business organizations. During his visit, he met with Taiwan's Minister of Education, Pan Wenxiong, along with other officials from the ministry. While their short ceremony was held to welcome the Prime Minister and his delegation and to showcase the work of Latoya Williams, a Vincentian teacher who recently moved to Taiwan to teach English. Minister of Education Pan Wenxiong expressed his pleasure at having Prime Minister Gonzalez visit and spoke of the work of his ministry's foreign language program. Sir Vincent and the Grenadines has a close relationship with Taiwan. Your Excellency has visited Taiwan nine times since 1996, so I'm sure that you are no stranger to Taiwan. <coughs> As Taiwan interacts with the international community, English language education has a very important role to play. The Ministry of Education has promoting the policy of teaching English starting from as early as the third grade in primary school since 2005. The student environment can have a critical impact on whether they can learn English and how well, but schools in Taiwan remote areas were unable to provide sufficient English teachers and good English learning environments. Therefore, in 2005, we began to employ foreign English teacher program to provide language and cultural stimulation for our remote area students. In the past, the foreign English teachers came from the United States, Canada, the United Kingdom, Australia, New Zealand, and South Africa. This year is very special uh, in that uh, Ms. Latoya Jackson, uh, a teacher from St. Vincent and Grenadines, has joined the team of foreign English teachers in Taiwan. Children of the remote areas generally have few opportunities for expose, uh, exposure to foreigners and foreign cultures. Having foreign English teachers greatly increase their opportunity to use English and it reduces the tension and feel about talking to foreigners. Uh, in addition to the foreign English teacher program, there are also 97 students from St. Vincent and Grenadines here in Taiwan studying Mandarin Chinese and other courses. I hope that through educational cooperation, our two countries will be able to have closer exchanges. Thank you again for visiting Taiwan. It's very join our national test celebration. I hope you enjoy the trip and I wish you all the best. Thank you very much. Thank you. Meanwhile, Prime Minister Gonzalez thanked Minister Pan for his warm welcome and pledged his continued support for the ongoing relations between the Republic of China and Taiwan and St. Vincent and the Grenadines. He also took the opportunity to congratulate Vincentian teacher Latoya Williams on the work she's doing for the foreign language program in Taiwan. I'm very happy to see your... your exchange teacher, your English language teacher, um, Latoya Williams, who is a magnificent woman. And we're very happy that she's here with us today. <laughs> St. Vincent and the Grenadines and the Republic of China, Taiwan. We have diplomatic relations now for 35 years. And the relations are getting stronger and stronger every day. And they had a an excellent meeting with my very dear friend, the President, Tsai Ing-wen. We had a discussion about matters pertaining to education and training of students. And both of us want to have more students from St. Vincent and the Grenadines to come here to, to Taiwan to study Mandarin and to study other important professional subjects. And equally, we want to see some Taiwanese students come to be with us in St. Vincent. And they will want the traffic to be one way. <laughs> I want you also, and you young ladies and young men, students, you may come. I'm sure Wendy you would like to come. <laughs> and Sherry and Mina and Benson I'm not doing badly yet. and, I, 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 and um, Candy and Owen and I'm sure would you like to come to St. Vincent and the Grand Beats? Huh? yes 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 and um, to meet your your colleagues we have a wide range of cooperation, but what is dearest to my heart, really the cooperation in the field of education. 
And as Latoya Williams probably would have told you, we have been carrying out an education revolution in our own country. But you really didn't come here to hear me speak. I came here to hear Latoya and to hear our dear students and everyone else. We will report back to St. Vincent and the Grenadines about this meeting. And I'm sure the people of St. Vincent and the Grenadines will be very pleased. And we will be overjoyed with the message that Latoya, whom we have sent as the first of our emissaries in the field of education, teaching, that we will have others coming. Latoya Williams is currently teaching in the Miaoli County, and her principal took the opportunity to speak of his school district and the ongoing work of their foreign language program. Our foreign teacher program is held by the Ministry of Education and the Miaoli County government so that we can hire a certified foreign teacher to teach our students. With a foreign teacher, our students become great enough to speak English. They are more interested in English class, and their English ability has improved. Here I want to share a story with you. In the beginning, our students meet the foreign teacher. They are very shy, about to say hello, nice to meet you. But after a year, they can smile, hug the foreign teacher, I feel they are confident. Uh, this is Latoya's life in Fangu Junior High School. This is uh, her new home. Uh, the apartment is near our school. It's just two minutes move, commute. Uh, Latoya's every day takes part in our morning meeting. After the meeting, she will talk to our students. Uh, our students enjoy Latoya's English class. They study high in class and are eager to participate in fun learning activities. This is Latoya. Latoya. Other foreign teachers arrive to join us for an activity. Uh, maybe it's a normal thing for urban schools to have a foreign teacher, but for us, it's a very special thing. Two years of interactive teaching with a foreign teacher equals the whole year of English teaching with a local teacher. I'm so grateful to the Ministry of Education and the Miami County government for taking care of our students. I'm so grateful of the country of Stevenson for providing a great teacher to teach our students. Because of this program, rural school students have hope for their future. Although our position is not easy, we will continue to never give up in Da Wu Junior School. Thank you very much. A few students from Latoya's English language class performed for Prime Minister Gonzales and his visiting delegation a poem about St. Vincent and the Grenadines by Michael Peters in English. Latoya then thanked both countries for the opportunity to teach English in Taiwan. Makes you want to reach for an ocean head. Makes you want to 
kiss the bed once, twice, St. Vincent and the Bernadies, paradise. Thank you. My St. Mary Oliver's fan has been very insightful, educational, interesting, and rewarding. I must express thanks to Angel, the Curriculum Advisor of Education, the Director of English Teaching Resource Center of Education, and the Vice Chairperson of, English, of the English Advisory Committee, and the rest of her team, including Vanessa and Tara, for being so accommodating and for going beyond the call of duty to lend assistance when necessary. Thank you so much. I'm also grateful for my, my foreign teacher's family here in Miaoli. I have learned a great deal from them during our training sessions and the activities we have embarked on together as a group. They make my stay here less lonely. I would also like to express appreciation to the principal, staff and students of the Dahu Junior High School for being very welcoming, helpful and assisting when necessary. A million thanks to the parents of Wendy, Sherry, Mina, Candy, Owen, and Benson. We only had six days to practice, and they did wonderful. Yes. Okay. We also applaud the efforts, your efforts, students, and we pray that your English will improve as I continue to be with you all. It's my desire to continue to put forward my best efforts during my classroom delivery activities and to continue exploring and experimenting with different ways that will be effective during my teaching learning activities at the Dahu Junior High School. Thank you.